Decommissioned Minister William Duma yesterday explaining why he had left government. His reason, he was apparently confused. Like uh, I got a sentiment made by the Minister for Petroleum. Um, uh, also, um, um, uh, confusion comes under the confusion. <laughs> so, uh, if you read the uh, standing orders and uh, the organic group carefully, I mean, power of the parliament, them rest on them, leader of government basically, and then he means uh, absent the uh, minister. While the United Resource Party leader explained his confused state of mind, least we forget last Friday when he joined the opposition rank and gave his explanation for leaving government, the minister clearly stated his reasons. I must emphasize that I've also been in parliament for quite a long time and I've served under so many different prime ministers. I've seen the performance of the economy uh, ups and downs over the years. Uh, most of you will remember that when our prime minister, James Marabe, announced his decision regarding POGRA, I was one of the first national leaders to actually uh, support this decision because I believed in our economy being controlled by our people. But I later realized, as we progressed through, I realized that there was no plan B. So my difficulties have always been trying to reconcile the ever-increasing demands of our country and the limited resource base and the lack of manufacturing capability of our country and the apparent inability of the government to be able to close some of the very important deals, such as the Papua LNG and the, long, the prolonged uh, Pogra gold mine uh, issues. So those are the reasons why I've decided to, uh, to leave the government and to be able to form this new partnership with fellow like-minded leaders who, uh, who I believe will be able to set out a new pathway for this country. Prime Minister James Marpe welcoming him back on Monday to the Lolawata government camp and on Tuesday allowing Duma the spotlight to explain his decision. We were all caught off guard by one or two who were running this dubious scheme behind the, behind the lines. So he will, he will say on what happened on Friday. And, uh... But as always in PNG politics, no coalition is final and as always unexpected to the very last minute. And in Mr. Duma's case, realization can come at any moment. On the Sunday Council of Friday, um, it caught all of us by surprise. And what you've done is simply undo the wrong and set it the ship for our country. Adelaide Sirox Kari, National, MTV News.